More coverage now. The race you decide now that Trey Radel has resigned from Congress amid a cocaine scandal. His fellow Republican, Elizabeth Benequisto, making some changes to her campaign website for state Senate as she runs for his old seat in Congress at the same time. Changes that came after former corner investigator Warren Wright began asking questions. Warren? Well, technically, Lizbeth Benequisto can run for both Congress and state Senate at the same time. I just wanted to know if it was legal to talk about her run for Congress on her state Senate campaign website. Her campaign staff tells me they were not doing anything inappropriate. But shortly after that line of questioning, the campaign took down that section of the website, and this is what it looks like now. Blank. This all started when I put together a timeline trying to figure out when Benequisto knew she was going to run for higher office. She purchased her domain website for Congress on December 30th, but she started running her commercials for state Senate January 6th to February 2nd. And then she announced her bid for Congress the next day, February 3rd. The political action campaign, Values Are Vital, alleged Benequisto was skirting federal election laws. A candidate who is running for Congress may not use money from special interests and lobbyists, but in a state race, they may. Values Are Vital is charging that Benequisto was using money, special interest money, to build up her name recognition. Then after spending that money, switching over to running for Congress. I got a chance to have a sit-down interview with Benequisto on Friday. You can go to our website and get a closer look at that entire story. Warren Wright, Fox 4, in your corner. All right.